weren't you on that podcast where Brian Johnson stood up and went because he just couldn't take it? Mm, just a PR campaign. Brian Johnson is saying he's reversed his age by 15 years. He looks as young as his son. No, absolutely not. He does not. Internet doctors can't be trusted, can they? I think nobody should be trusted point blank. In India, the problem is that people who look fit aren't really fit. These are young people who go to the gym but are getting heart attacks in their 30s and their 40s. You know how many of those deaths happen in the gym? Those are handful of deaths. But nobody's talking about those deaths. We don't show people sitting in their toilet seats and dying of heart attacks. But that's almost 50 to 60 percent of the people who die of heart attacks and die in their homes. What what keeps you away from GLP? Nobody's asking for a longitudinal study in India. Why do we have to become lab rates? Why do you think Serena Williams has endorsed JLP1? I mean, it's her company. Her husband's. Yeah, I mean, you should never trust American products and brands because they are really good at marketing. There are much better countries to learn from. China has increased their average height by almost 8 centimeters. Hmm. Where India has actually reduced it by 1 centimeter. It's put right here. You know who I'm talking about, right? You've had your own thoughts on the Pinder Goyal's startup. I'm sorry, where's the proof? This whole longevity thing is basically a narrative. They are sending notifications at night that ask people to eat chole bhature. What are your thoughts on Temple? The biggest problem with the Pinder Goyal's hypothesis. I'm shocked you're saying it.